One of the changes that we introduced on the art side coming to Ghost Recon Phantoms is having a phantom side of, of the ghosts. For visual artists, of course, we need to start with an idea. We flesh it out by using concept art. Basically, concept art will help us to channel the idea, the color, to the management. Let everyone alert them what we are doing, what will the end product look like. Talking about the maps, it's coming from the concept art and the direction from the art directors, of course it's Marlowe. And then from there we're going to translate his idea, his visions into the games, the Cosicon Phantoms. And what I'm doing, I work closely with the technical artists. We set up the tools, we iterate the tools to make the artist's life make it easier. It's so also when we start from level design, it's all about making something fun. And when the artist comes in, it's all about making the level design invisible to the player. It needs to feel like it's a real place. It's not designed by someone. I'm just here and trying to capture a point. We have one new map for Ghost Recon Phantom. It's called Dr. Wilson's Art Gallery. It's a spiral map, it's display art, and then the location is based on Taiwan. It's pretty interesting. It was an existing map. We are trying to relight it on our new lighting system. In this Ghost Recon Phantoms, we try to push all of the new technology into existing map. All of the new lighting uh, happen in all of the maps instead of the, just the new maps. So. I can't wait to see what your guys' reaction about the new maps, the new lighting. Should be super excited. One of the major challenges that the art team has faced would be the constant improvement of our pipelines. Because once we start shipping more and more packs and hats, we will run into this difficulty of creating something that's fresh, but also within the brand. We are not a fantasy or a cartoony game, and we're a fairly hardcore military shooter. And we need to find that balance between creating something that's appealing and something that's still believable, and something that fits the Tom Clancy brand. I create character animations, I make our characters move, reload weapons, jump over things, take cover. 